this is the presentation uh, for the final, finally for the release of the uh, Dunville's Fior 18 year old single malt Port Morant rum furnace Irish whiskey, the longest um, title yeah, in Irish whiskey. Hence the big label on and, the box. And, and hence the big box, and the longest wait for a product in a long time. Um, yeah, as I said before, it was important for us to try and put, to try and get the world's attention with Dunville's, to try and just show how. You know that we can mix it with anybody, and um, just to try and get people's attention. And we thought we had this rum for an 18 year old whiskey that was just a stunning, a sublime whiskey, and we wanted to um, to put it in a presentation that would do it justice and would put the Dunville's brand um, back where it belonged. And we maybe went a bit overboard. <laughs> no, I wouldn't <laughs> uh, say that. No. Interest, but yeah. So um, a lovely gloss, very heavy gloss wooden box. Obviously, very much heritage brand colours, uh, and it's with Dunfells, it's all about the heritage of the brand. So, everything we do from now on will be very much heritage driven on, on the old history of the brand. So, we take the top off very carefully, okay. and um, we have several components in this box, not just the whiskey itself. Um, my sister Anne Marie works in the distillery on the uh, PR side, and Anne Marie has been um, working for a year now on uh, this book and this book will tell the history of Dunville's uh, through story and advertisements. Yeah. Um, the history of Dunville's uh, born 1808, reborn 2012. So Dunville's Royal Irish Theatre is open 1808. Close that's that's close a substantial, substantial book. Yeah, it's um, uh, well you... I mean it, 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 it's a lovely um, hardback uh, Bound book, very tactile. I mean, a, a, a lovely, a lovely accompaniment for a glass of for a glass of the whiskey. Yeah. And um, we've been a long time putting this together, trying to tell that, trying to tell the story of Dunville's from 1808 through to 1936 and beyond, and then from 2012 when we lifted the brand. And um, as I said before, our um, our ethos with Dunville's was let's put it at the, let's put it back where it belongs at the very top of world whiskies at the top table of world whiskies. And um, and that's what we've always tried to do through the PX10, the PX12, the the three crowns patent, and now the. Um, well, the as you know, we were, release. we're big fans of paper, as you know. And oh yeah, I, I mean, it, it's, I'm it, looking at this, and, and, and I can see the stitch binding, and I can yeah, see the quality I mean, of the it's, paper, it's just, the it's, quality it's, of the print. It's so tactile, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah. People. There's a third dimension to this there, paper as well. There, there it's is. Not I, mean, just, uh, I, I, I just find that so important. You know, and how, how smell things in your, yeah, yeah, I mean, and those it. things just create uh, an ambience, and they, and they yeah. just, you know, they, yeah. I mean, if you don't do it, I, I get, even if you don't do it, let's do it, let's do it right. And you know, again, there, there's no expense spared here. No. Um, I suppose once you lift this book out, yeah. uh, the surprise patterns, which I haven't told anybody about, um, of, of what's in here. So once. You, lift this book out. Uh, what we have here is a small vial, a small bottle of 41 year old Port Morant rum. Okay. Now, this is mad stuff. 41 year old 41 Port year old Port Morant rum. Um, the story of the craft from this whiskey is very important. Um, three, 15 years in bourbon, then three years in these Port Morant uh, 40, these crafts previously held 41 year old Port Morant rum. And we talked about it, and we talked about it, and we talked about this rum. And we thought, you know, rather than tell people oh, about it, let's, let's let them try the rum. Let's let them make the connection. Let's let them make the connection. Let's give them this, again, it's been taking an experience and, and building that experience and making it more. So let's take, let's take the rum and let, let's put a small sample of the rum in the bar so if people can taste the rum from where the whiskey came. Yeah. Now, this is 41-year-old Port Morant Demerara rum. This retails for £2,200 a bottle. This is mad stuff. I mean, th this wee bottle here might have cost us 50 quid. Yeah. You know, it, it's unreal. And it's not what you expect. It mm -hmm. is li it's layer upon layer, complexity upon complexity. It, it's just madness in a bottle. It's not, I mean, 41 year olds it, it doesn't have that tropical freshness. It is, you know, it's wood. And, but thankfully it was recast at 21 years. So okay. after 21 years it was recast in a fresh bourbon. So what you're not getting 
it's that exhausted craft, those tannins coming through and that, you know, bitterness and, and yeah. exhausted wood coming through. So, it, so it's it still is, lively. Yeah, it's still lively. I mean, it's 41 years old, yeah. so it's going to be more complex than lively. But, um, yeah, um, we talked so much about the rum that we just figured, let's put the rum in, let's put the rum mines up, let's people, let people taste the rum itself. And then they will, whenever we talk about that layer upon layer of demerara sugars and Muff Gravado sugars and prickles and how they're different. You, know, you taste this, and this is all about the different layers of sugar as much as anything, and just pure banana bread and and um, even the colour apple strudels and yeah, I mean it's mad. So um, so yeah, th that that that's an experience that I don't think um, I, I don't know that's been offered before in a package where where you can you, you can actually experience the, the liquid in which the whiskey was finished in. Yeah, so it brings um, a traceability almost to the... Yeah, know. and it's just a different experience. It's, different, it's a different... It, 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 it's all about your experience in these days. We want to visit, you know, we want to visit where your food is made and where your cider is made and where your beer and your whiskey and you want to get to the very heart of it and go back to the province of it and go back to the to their raw ingredients and understand where it all flows from and this is just a perfect way of doing that, you know, is putting yeah. that whiskey into... A lovely yeah, and it's a lovely that, surprise you know, under the book yeah, as well. Yeah. Which is I'm uh, talking about surprises, so we have the the bottle of, the, the bottle of whiskey itself, which is stunning. The rum, which is just um, mad and, and, and glorious and stunning in equal measure. Yeah. We have the book, which has um, disappeared. <laughs> um, what I have here? Oh yeah, so we have the book. Yeah. And one final thing we put into the box if that's the right word. So Dunville's brand, famous for its mirrors. Yes. As we all know, um, Dunville's mirrors are in every bar in Ireland yeah. and our season has now for, for some serious money. I was offered one this morning for £6,000, uh, which is probably, two. probably on the money, <laughs> but um, we're trying to build warehouses. So, um, but anyway, D the Dunville's brand, famous for its mirrors. So what we have done is so let's see um, here so we can is show this. The so we have put a proper lead glass mirror into the back of the lid of every box. So that's the front as you see it guys and uh, explains quite a bit of the weight behind it, the whole thing. I mean this must be half the package weight. It almost. explains a lot of the weight and the rest is for protection. Yeah, well, that's <laughs> but beautiful. Again we talked about doing a package unlike anything that I have experienced before, or uh, unlike anything that I'm aware of as we out before, and, and, and this is it. Yeah. And as I say at the start, we might have gone a bit overboard, <laughs> yeah. um, but um, Shane was having fun, yeah. and, and again, he wanted to perfectly capture the ethos of Dunville's in this release. The, the the ethos of it, the premiumality of it, the importance of the brand, the heritage and history of the brand, and bring it to a new audience, and to try and and to try and get people's attention. And I, well, think, I mean, it certainly I makes a statement, will, a very bold one. It is. It's a statement piece, and that's yeah. exactly what it is. It's a statement piece. That's beautiful. Um, and that serves you us, as I say, is is that. Okay. Well. Uh, while I do a runner with this. Uh, <laughs> thanks very much, Charlotte. Bye bye. <laughs> Security. <laughs>